Hey, this is like annoying because um, my computer is super slow right now. I was making a video. I don't even know if, oh yeah, whatever. I was making a video and now my computer like doesn't want to work. It's like not wanting to shut down or anything. Bruh. Ugh, it's annoying. So, yeah, but it's, I was talking about, oh, this is so annoying. I was talking about how my cousin was like, oh, you haven't posted in six days. I'm like, yeah, babe, I got life. <laughs> um, but it's funny. So, basically, what I said in my other video <laughs> was that I think I'm going to start a podcast. So, We'll see about that. Um, but I wouldn't tell any of you. <laughs> I wouldn't say the name. Um, because I would probably tell one. Maybe. I'd probably tell one person about it. Bro. To quit and un. <sighs> okay. I'm just literally going to hold the power button. It's that easy. Because I don't know what the fuck to do. I don't know so yeah i would tell i would probably only tell like one person but um oh my god is it like blurring my background out like on purpose that's kind of cool um yeah i don't know i have like thoughts about it so um i might let my hoes on my podcast but who, who knows <laughs> um so yeah that's one of my things right now today i went to work uh at my new like it's so i quit my soup kitchen job and now i'm only working at like this teaching thing position or whatever um and i teach little kids obviously uh <laughs> and um my attention span is so low I teach little kids science stuff, and I got I was being observed today by my like supervisor. Oh my god, it was so embarrassing! Like, uh, the kids were just running amok type thing, and they really liked me, and they were all energetic, but it was still like, oh, they're running amok. So, yeah, she critiqued me on it, and she was like, you know, you were really uh, enthusiastic and stuff, but like they you didn't really have their attention. I was like, bro, I'm gonna kill myself. So. There was that. Um, and what else? I think that was like the biggest thing that she said, which was good because not like other things really that, that like needed to be changed. Um, and yeah. So, um, is that melatonin? Is that what that says? Um, fuck me, man. So, what else? So then, yeah, then I had, uh, then I finished and I went home. I took Juan out today with me to go to Glendale to pick up some supplies. And then I went to Giamella's, so bomb. It's in Burbank on Magnolia. Go check them out. Shout out to Giamella's, not sponsored, but uh, I should be though. So, uh, oh my god! And I had my first comment. Ah, shout out to Adam, bro. Um, was it's so funny, like having someone comment or like my cousin when she when she texted me, she was like, um. What she said? She was like, oh, hey, you haven't posted in, in, in like, six days. I was like, I got fans, bro. But, um, that would be cool. I don't know. Even though it's, like, I have three followers. But, like, uh, um, it's just cool that, like, I have, like, little... It's cool that I have a support system <laughs> and people rooting for me. Uh, so, yeah. Um... What else? I'm trying to think. Oh, and the original video that I had 
started making before my computer was like all wonky uh i was talking about how i had a conversation with one of my friends uh and it's really nice because in this conversation like me, me and this person uh what's it called i really like like our, our like relationship because uh he whoa that looks so cool um oh yeah because we don't talk like often or whatever and i like that <laughs> because and it's like so like i don't have to this is gonna sound like i don't know but like i don't really have to like put so much effort into like the friendship <laughs> like i don't have to like like talk to him every day or i don't know like not that i have to talk to any anybody every day but um like I have expectations with other friendships that it's like no i have to talk to them pretty often to maintain it which is totally cool like i obviously um but yeah this is like the one friendship that uh, one of the friendships that i have that's like yeah like don't worry and when we do hang out it's like just so like i don't know it's so cool and, and it's so refreshing because like i don't know i was talking to other homie about like how i feel like shit is so superficial right now like like the conversations i'm having with like people and like stuff like is so like i don't know it's yeah it's just so superficial and so like hey what'd you do today oh bro like nothing i got out of bed and and, and my shampoo was low and then I had to go to the store and bro, when I was at the store, some lady was just being so rude and, and, but it's fine, whatever. And then afterwards I went to get some King Taco and it's just like, okay, now what? Or a question that my uh ap lit teacher i think i i always mix up ap lit and ap lang but uh something that he always like instilled or whatever in, in like the class uh, and whenever we wrote papers presentations whatever there was a sole question that he made us ask ourselves in terms of like answering the question because anyone can like if the the prompt whatever the prompt was like in order to really answer it because how do i say this how do i say this anyone can like explain something but the question is so what like okay uh the purpose of Fahrenheit 451 is to talk about the dystopian society and, uh, like, whatever, okay? So what? So what? It's, oh, so what? It's a dystopian society. All right, cool. Good story. Like, you know what I mean? And I feel like we're just not there. We're like, yeah, dystopian society. So what? Like, <sighs> I should get that tattooed, bro, on my fucking brain. You know what? Shout out Mr. Lewis. I'm gonna, I'm gonna mess with that man. Quote unquote. So what? You know? I don't know. Moral dilemma, bro. My hair is looking kind of cute. I it's it might look short, but I have that shit pinned up in the back right here. Um. Yeah. I don't know. So what? so oh so going back though with oliver like uh yeah uh i'm so cute going back with like oliver and stuff uh last time i went to santa cruz bro it was so nice like it was such a change of pace like going from like the valley where it's like everything's happening to, 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 like you gotta be doing something like i don't know it's not like la la you know what i mean but it's still like it's like oh my god bro but like santa cruz it's like everybody's a fucking tree hugger and everybody, everybody's just like you know like it's very chill very slow everybody like rides their bike and you know they go surfing and shit like that like okay bruh like i don't know it's 
so much better. I don't know. Uh, I don't know. Uh, I liked having that change of pace. It was very, very nice. And, like, oh, and then, like, so, like, the, with the conversation I had with Oliver, though, he had an issue. Like, he had a problem. He was, like, he called me. He's, like, I'm not feeling, what, like, good about something. Like, somebody, something that she said, like, uh, was, I'm trying to, like, make this, like, very ambiguous. <laughs> Not to spill his business, but uh, something that he said, something that someone said to him hurt his feelings. And I was like, okay, but why are you personalizing it? Like, that's what's hurting you. It's not what they said, but it's like that you're making it about you. Do you get what I'm saying? And he was like, okay. And then the person called him back because they, I don't know, whatever. And uh, so then after like a few minutes or like, I don't know, whatever, he calls me back. He's like, yeah, so I told her, I told her like that I was just personalizing it and then I'm not mad and now we're getting dinner tomorrow. <sighs> like, you know, like if it's that easy, why aren't we doing it? And then it, so like that just like refreshes me to be like, okay, don't personalize shit, you know, like that's it was such an easy fix. Like we blow so much shit out of proportion that it's kind of fucking insane. Like, when I was in IOP, uh, intensive outpatient, um, one of the therapists was talking about, like, we're, it was a mindfulness session, and one of the therapists was like, like, what is it, like, 5% of our problems are, like, real, and, like, they're problems. 95% of the rest of the stress that comes with it is shit that we blew out of proportion, like, we're making it so much more of a problem than it needs to be and it's kind of like i don't know if uh it's kind of like the golden gate bridge people who like try to kill themselves off the golden gate bridge and the survivors they're like oh when i as soon as i like jumped i realized that all the pro things that i thought were problems could have been solved and it's like uh, i don't know it makes me sad and it's like damn imagine the people who didn't make it like is that what they were thinking? That's fucked up. But that's what I'm saying. Is like... I don't know if you can hear that. It's only TV out loud. But... Yeah. Um, we're just blowing shit out of proportion. And... Uh, I don't know what to do about it. I don't know what to do about it. Sorry, hold on. What the fuck? Oh, there it is. So, yeah. That's why I think it's like... Mm. I don't know. Oh, but it's really refreshing to talk to him because it brings to light, like... Or he'll act too, like, when I tell him about something, like, yeah, I'm not feeling good either. Like, this is what happened or something. He's like, he's like okay but he's not telling me okay why'd you personalize now just kidding but he'll he'll say something else like like uh, okay but don't you think it's valid for the other person to feel that way and that like you're angry because you're hurt instead of like um and instead of being petty like just express why don't you express your hurt and i'm like <laughs> but yeah Either way, I love talking to Oliver, like, like when we have do our conversations. And it's so out of the blue whenever, like, hey, can you call on Friday? Like, no. The food just calls me. I, I just call that food sometimes. You know what I mean? But, yeah. Um, enjoy those conversations. It's a little thing, you know? Um, oh, shit. Sorry. <laughs> so, yeah. I think, uh... I think I have a great support system. That's what I think. And... Yeah. Anyways, I'm gonna keep this short. I'm <laughs> just kidding, it's fucking 15 minutes. Um, 
yeah uh i'm feeling good so let's see how long this shit keeps up over and out